talk to you about the Fuji GW672. Let's go. This is the Fuji GW672. It, it is a 6x7 medium format uh, rangefinder film camera. Uh, it is fully mechanical, meaning that it, it takes no batteries. It um, has no built-in light meter, unfortunate, unfortunately. Um, but you know, it's a sturdy piece of camera. You got a fixed set-on lens. You can't take this thing off. It's a 90 millimeter uh, Fujinon uh, lens with a field of view around 40 millimeter and, and 35 mil equivalent. Uh, if that's how you say that. Sorry, I'm Swedish. If I say anything wrong, that's because I'm Swedish. I can't, I don't know all the words, maybe. Maybe I do, maybe I don't. Just don't hold it against me, right? And so, you also got on top of this nifty lens right here, you got all your settings. You have to slide this out. It's a, it's a little like lens hood. You have to, it's, it's also attached to, to the lens. You slide it out and you get all your uh, apertures and, and uh, shutter speeds and stuff like that. And you put your focus here. So basically everything you need is on the lens itself. And then you, you know, shoot your photos by using either this one or this one, which is, yeah, that's right. Two different buttons, but they produce the actual same and you just, yeah, you know, the same thing. It's two different shutter buttons, but it's just for different versions. Or if you want to use your camera like this, you can put your finger right there. If you want to use your camera like this, you can put it right up there. So it's just a nifty way of, you know, uh, reaching your shutter button because this camera is fucking huge. Yeah, that's right. It's, it's not small. It's pretty big, actually. It's like a brick. Everybody says it's a brick. It's called the Texas Leica. It's available in different versions as well. If you want to get this, there's the six, uh, sorry, six by, uh, six by eight, six by nine, and six by seven. And then there's all the, the you know, in betweeners where you get like different models, like one, two, three. There's a, I think there's a model or uh, an earlier version of it, or set, like a slightly different version of it that you can actually take the lens off. Uh, and put I'm not sure what they what kind of lenses they made for that But you can actually take the lens out and that's nice, but in this version you can't And this is the version we're talking about. So uh, On the top you got different film uh, Films, I guess you can put in 220 film uh, It gives you 20 exposures and the in the middle uh, which is the one I guess a lot of people use is the uh, 10 exposure 120 uh, option and then there's a weird thing on the bottom here. Uh, it's a five exposure, five exposure, uh, 120 film. I don't know about that. If you know anything about that feature, please uh, write in the comments below. I would love to know. Uh, other than that, you got your little flash thing sink right here, right next to the lens. Underneath this thing, you got a pretty nice thing actually. It's a counter. It counts how many rolls you put through the camera. Um, I love that. I don't know why you would, but it's nice to know if you're, uh, if, you know, if you're ever thinking of buying one of these and you know, want to know, you want to know how many films or how many uh, how many rolls the guy put through it or the girl for that matter, put through the camera. You know, you can see it right here. Uh, it has three numbers in a row, so it might be that you know it goes to nine hundred ninety nine and then goes to zero and starts over. I don't know if, if that's how it works, but it, I mean, logically it wouldn't break if it's like goes over 999. So I'm guessing it restarts, but mine is a sh like this camera is so beat up. I got scratches and like paint falling off it and like stuff like that. But, and th this, this counter says 860. So it's, um, if I'm not mistaken, that's pretty correct. Uh, if it's been to 999 and then, you know, gone all the way to 860 again, then, well, good job. Because it still produces fucking super good images. And that's what's uh, so great about this camera. 
that's why I want to talk about it. It has a beautiful uh, rangefinder, a little patch in the middle, which is super clear. Uh, Viewfinder is clear. Um, yeah, that's basically it. I don't know what else to talk about about this, about this camera. Um, it's just a brilliant camera. I'm gonna show you some images that I made with it and hopefully you like him. I like him, it's my work. But if you like him, uh, you know, go to my Instagram, uh, maybe follow me or, or not. Uh, just know that this camera does make beautiful images. If you like this video, please like it. Also, you can write nice things uh, point it towards me in the in the comments below uh, you can write stuff like hey I like your video or hey don't put up a video unless you drink water you thought I was gonna say something bad right I wasn't mm. keep it clean down there and uh, you know see you for the next one bye